I love Victor Odo. My name is Lynette Crosby. Um, I created RLTA.com, A-R-L-T-A, All Roads Lead to Ascension. And I'm coming to you as a person who is an awakened soul. And um, I have been for the past seven years. And I have been a uh, student and a teacher and a guide uh, to those who want it. And I have been drawn, I ask my guides, my higher self, my angels, archangels, ascending masters, my heart, my thymus gland, uh, and my soul, whether or not it would be for the highest and best good to contact you. And that's what I'm doing here now. I'm contacting you because I am contacting light workers to get a, um, a message and an understanding and to help to reveal to other light workers that there, a lot of us are going through a lot of things that we think are a part of our spiritual journey that we are learning to settle for and live with because of our water and our water is experiencing trauma um, and it has been for a long time the trauma that our water is experiencing is radiation and uh, we've been taught to look at radiation like it's this oh my gosh you know the worst thing that you can possibly imagine when in reality the uh, easiest way to suppress our uh, ability to grow and raise our vibration to that higher love that we're all seeking is this slow um, accumulation over time of radiation in the body this is why there are so many people that are having so many unexplained sicknesses healing um, um, and pains uh, illnesses and pains on top of that for light workers what happens is when we are exposed to that I'm gonna put you on pause for one moment okay the plane went by um, on top of that light workers who are awakened are experiencing a lot of trauma in different dimensions on different levels of their when they sleep uh, because of that radiation it's making us be open to psychic and energetic low vibration frequencies um, in a lot of cases attack in different forms and it's something that I have found through my own personal research over the past seven years the solutions to and the solutions I will tell you right now are very very simple the solutions are a shower filter that structures the water um, the shower filter itself costs a hundred dollars it does have to be changed out depending on how many people are using it um, and then there is I'm having people use distilled water now um, and there is a company that sells water filtration uh, systems um, and I still use them but the water filtration system only lasts for, it used to last a year, it's now lasting three months because the chemicals in the water have been upped. And so there are things that we can do to remove those chemicals from the body, like zeolite. Zeolite is a powdered form of crystal. Zeolite is one of the most amazing things. It's a, it forms a cage-like structure, which attaches to the radioactive particles, and it helps them to move through the body without traumatizing the body clarity peace of mind getting unstuck being able to move being able to communicate without saying um 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 all the time being able to just be there for those who need it in your life and, and it's amazing for pets it's amazing for children it stops nightmares it gets them out the fright zone and the psychic attack that they're going through animals um, that they say are aging and they start to have things like hip dysplasia which is one of the symptoms of fluoride poisoning um, is, is hip dysplasia when your hip is out and you, you walk with a limp um, you, you'll start to see that all of that reverse I've seen people once they get on it and they start to remove the radiation from their body uh, that the rashes go away um, you know the once it gets to a, a, a where you've been exposed to it long enough you'll start to get overwhelming opening sores and etching and scratching and all of that starts to dissipate um, and once you're not in pain right once you get to the point where you're saying what do I do with my life when I'm no longer distracted by pain you're able to get into your spirituality but when we're focused on our when we're focused on our pain we can't think past that base need and 
that's how come a lot of people are feeling frustrated with those around them. How come they're not waking up? How come they're not moving forward? They're not moving forward because us as the people who woke up before them are bringing in the answers to help to make their process not as um, hard. On top of that, a lot of uh, people will notice that when they start to do this process that they have a lot of distraction coming at them because there are things and energies um, that are controller energies or uh, some people call themselves targeted individuals that are experiencing these things because they are so powerful and once they get out of the fright zone because that's what this does they're able to find their way so the other things that I didn't mention are selenium iodine zeolite and selenium iodine zeolite oh and zeolite is in a number of forms so you have a powdered form that is called intrinsic zeolite that you can use in the bath or you can use in the um, you can use in the bath or you can use in the in your laundry to actually remove the radioactive particles from your clothing so that you're not putting that on every single time you wash it's something that you can replace your your actual laundry with um, add or add it to your the t detergents that you're used to using and then there's um, selenium which comes in liquid or powder I'm um, in a liquid or a pill form and the selenium I, I like to offer both because a lot of people have pill traumas from being forced medicated from ADHD you know any kind of medical things or issues that they've had and uh, the number one is iodine iodine and selenium are a powerhouse team that work together to remove it from the um, the, thi uh, the um, thyroid as well as the endocrine system but they have to be used in combination uh, but it is something that is definitely the foundation I believe that uh, that is helpful to every single light worker out here because it helps to raise your vibration out of that fright zone I recently had my water filter run out because um, I'm seven people are using it and I wasn't able to get another one right away and I went right back down into that fright zone and I was experiencing energetic uh, attack and I was experiencing things that were challenging to me and I was just like I know what to do to get out of it there's so many people that don't there's so many light workers that are like me uh, that were blaming themselves because I was using my water filter that used to last a year and then I moved so I wasn't able to use it like I, I used to and I thought I was being punished energetically I thought I was being punished I thought I took the wrong turn spiritually I thought I had done something wrong and then I saw a friend of mine and their nails were growing um, and it w and they were deformed and I've known this person for 11 years and then I, I looked at them and I knew immediately that it was radiation and I started to first make sure that I had what I need and, and get my all of the things together and gather my supplies and then from there I realized that people need this this information it's time and we need to connect with one another through getting off of that radiation through getting the right things around you through supplementation we are able to find our way out of the fright zone and into the freedom zone in a way that we never knew was possible. Through doing this process, I have released 80 pounds. Um, and I found other people who are 110 pounds and 98 pounds, they start, their weight starts to level off because they're not being, uh, our body responds, our bodies respond differently depending on the chemicals that we are exposed to. And, um, and so with people, they'll balance out if they need to gain weight and they'll balance out if they need to release weight and um, and what they need to gain is their their you know love of life and that zest for life again and when I release what no longer served me as far as the weight is concerned I started releasing the weight of emotion I started releasing the weight of the chemicals that my body was storing in the fat cells to um, to help me to remove the um to help protect me because weight is not a weight loss or weight gain issue it is a protection um and some people have it more in one way or the other and i understand that i um so i wanted to share that i wanted to share that with you i i used to be a i studied to be a personal trainer until i was 18. i became a raw food chef 
for uh, over five years. I could make some of the best food from the best restaurants, or, and, and I mean the best, best, best fruits and, fruits and vegetables, the best organic fruits and vegetables. I had a Bowflex, a treadmill, an ab uh, rocker. I used to go to hot yoga three times a week. I used, uh, I had a personal trainer come in to train me in my home. I would go be on the treadmill, run four miles a day, uh, four miles a day on the treadmill. And yet and still, I could not lose one to 15 pounds. And I couldn't understand why. And people around me would look and say, you eat something, you eat the best, you do the best, you do everything. Why is it that you're not changing? I drank my water, those eight cups of water that they told us to drink. And I would be, I would fast, I would do everything that I needed to do. And, uh, you know, I would fast three times a year to, I mean, four times a year to detox at the, um, at the, the different, uh, what is it? Okay. Now the seasons, uh, to help myself to cleanse my body. I would do parasite cleanse, all of the above, and yet and still I would not lose or release any weight. And then I started to focus on, okay, what do I need to do to support myself? Because it got to the point where my th thyroid was out to here. Um, you know, I was having a, t I was suffering from insomnia until the age of 38 years old. Um, and there were so many things that I put into place to help me. Um, things like energetic tools that I make on my site and um, and understanding that your mattress is an antenna and it picks up the dirty electricity all things that, that you probably know and are well aware of and um, and the when I started on the iodine and the selenium I started noticing 10 10, 10 pounds released from me um, I started processing my emotions and releasing those toxic relationships that I had around me and I started noticing that I would have, you know, 10, 15, 20 pounds just released from me once I released those toxic relationships because of the energetic cords and holds that were on me. So this is just a little bit of, of kind of get to know me and what, what I do. Um, my goal is to do this for the highest and best good. My, do, my goal is to do this for the love of everything everyone mother earth all dimensions in all ways and that's how i love myself i love myself in all ways beyond time all dimensions all universes all galaxies all situations all circumstances all forms all possibilities all i integrate the fragmented parts of myself into my heart i have met my soul i have met my ego I have met my shadow self, I have met my reflection, and I love on them every single day. I want to share this information that those with those who seek it, because I have spent a lot of time trying to drag people who didn't want the information along. And once I learned from that, I started to work with people who wanted it. And I've seen some amazing uh, advances in those who have been teaching for a long time and some who have just woken up. The foundation is all the same. We have these abilities and these gifts that become a challenge to us. One, hold on one moment. Flame's gone. Um, we have these gifts and talents that can become a challenge to us because we're on radiation, raising our vibration. And that is not a healthy combination. There are many other things that I can share with you, but I hope that if this interests you, if it resonates with you in any way, please contact me. I've sent you an email along with this video, and there you will find my information. You can email me at arelta at arelta.com. You can respond to the email that I sent you, or you can call me at the number provided in the email. I thank you. I am grateful to you. I acknowledge and I celebrate what you have been doing with, for the community of awakened people, including me finding your videos, you know, and it's only been over the past few months that I have been watching you, uh, but you were someone that when I got guided, my guide said, okay, it's time um, for you to start to connect with others, um, that 
you were one of those people that were, you know, that popped into my stream of divine love. And I was like, oh my gosh, yes, yes. Um, so I'm excited to make this video today. And I have definitely come out and prepared for it. And hopefully I will be hearing from you soon. If this does not resonate with you, I understand it. I, I completely accept and, and respect your no. And I wanna let you know that no keeps me on my path and you on yours. So thank you, uh, divine love and divine joy and the highest and best good and blessings to you and all your family and those that you, you work with and teach and thank you. Uh, I really do appreciate you. And that's that, higher love. Have a good day.